up y'all welcome back to my channel it's your girl the jazz marie if you're new welcome to my channel and if you're returning welcome back gang so as y'all read by the title today i'm going to be putting y'all down on how to just stay smelling fresh all summer long in this texas heat y'all it's no joke so you need to really think about your hygiene especially especially if you live in like hot places so we're just gonna be running through literally everything from your mouth to your feet all the like we just going through everything okay let's just go ahead and jump right into this video for oral hygiene i don't know if i showed y'all y'all have seen in my videos i use like an electric toothbrush my dentist told me that electric toothbrushes are better than the manual ones that you use with just your hand because you're not putting as much pressure as you would with like a manual toothbrush because it vibrates on its own. It does the work for you. So this is a Philips Son Sony Care. This is a really good toothbrush. I definitely recommend because it gets all of those like, what's it called? Um, plaque buildup off of your teeth love that toothbrush and the toothpaste that i use is the regular just colgate optic white nothing special it keeps your mouth keeps that breath smelling fresh i don't know about y'all but i take flossing very seriously too so you can't just brush your teeth and not floss like that's not that's, that's not how it works because you got plaque buildup which causes the stinky breath as well so i use my oral b charcoal mint you can get these from your local grocery store i dilute hydrogen peroxide with water and i use this as a mouthwash so after i brush my teeth i'll like i already have a water bottle that i put the hydrogen peroxide in and then i'll use that after i floss so i'll brush my teeth then i'll floss you know sometimes when you floss you bleed and things like that I put the hydrogen peroxide in a water bottle i shake it up do whatever and i gargle that first and you're gonna like see when you spit it out like the foam and stuff then i go in with like a mouthwash that has an actual scent i had used two different mouthwashes so i'm currently using right now the listerine cool mint everybody has this listerine it's very popular i really like this mouthwash but i recently just started to use this mouthwash it's called their bread and this has become like honestly my new favorite mouthwash. When I tell y'all I don't have like no scent in my breath when I use this and it really does last for 24 hours dead ass. Can y'all see? Okay, well this is just a tongue scraper. I bought a new one today. You can get it from Walmart, Target, anywhere. And like I told y'all in one of my other videos, the tongue carries the most bacteria. It's fucking gross. And you need to make sure that you're... If you don't have one of these, at least brushing your tongue, anything. Because your tongue is what holds that stank ass bread. Now let's get into body hygiene. If you don't know... Where have you been? Because my favorite, all-time, all-time, all-time favorite body wash is the Method Body. And this one, is it focusing or like what? This one, y'all, it's the Coconut Rice Milk and Shea Butter. When I tell y'all, it lathers up so good. It just... I know people are really strong on like using a bar soap and using a body wash but when you use method body you don't have to do all the back and forth you can just literally use this as your soap i haven't tried any other scent but that's just because this one is like my og like it smells so good so fresh like i cannot make it up and then the lather like remarkable my favorite scrub right now is the buff and ready this is by soap and glory it's very like it smells so good it's like a mature scent. Like, I'm not really into, like, the fruity scents right now. I'm, I feel like I'm maturing up. Like, I used to like the really, like, tropical. I do like tropical, but I just want something mature and just, like, fresh. Because I feel like those scents, when you put it together with, like, the lotion that you're going to use and the perfume, like, it just all needs to go together. My favorite, my favorite, my favorite right now is the Buff and Ready, like I just said, from Soap and Glory. It's like, I can't even, like, describe the scent. It's just, it's like... It smells so fucking good. But when I exfoliate, I also use these 
they're really like for your face i guess i got them from amazon i'm gonna link it down below but it comes in a 10 pack which is why i love it because you know these like this that you get from ulta like the little petty scrubs they're 4.99 and you only get one even though you do get 20 uses out of them like baby i'd rather pay 4.99 for a pack of 10. even though i like don't like paying 4.99 for one i really love these petty scrubs because it comes with soap and it comes with like it just it smells good it has a scent it just really does work good i can't lie about it but it is 4.99 for only one but you do get a lot of uses i have mine in one of these ziploc bags because after i use it i just like put it up and i don't want it just sitting out so i have it in a ziploc bag and then you can also you can also use like a bar soap that's exfoliating and you can just use the bar soap without like a washcloth which is what i really like as well i really like this one by method body y'all know how i feel about the method body natural it makes you feel moisturized like i just love method body they need to come out with a lotion and if they do that after this video comes out y'all know who said it first after i wash my body i'm telling y'all the real tea like you gonna use the method body first then you're gonna go in with I'm telling you, you have to you have to get this. It smells so good. I also use an in the shower lotion. The one that I use doesn't really have a scent though, so it's not really going to contribute to like you smelling fresh or anything like that. It's just going to have you feeling moisturized. Now let's get to a little kitty cat down there. You're going to want to use any type of feminine wash, but I personally really enjoy this VH Essentials daily feminine wash you can get this from cvs that's the only place or cvs or walgreens it has like a little bit of a mint smell not too much it's not mint it's tea tree oil but it has tea tree oil prebiotics cranberry natural extracts and other ingredients that help level out your ph balance i literally live by this stuff if you're not using a feminine wash i don't know you need to start using one it's gonna have your coochie smelling fresh all day and obviously you don't want to use any type of soap or anything like that down there we have so much moisture down there i just feel like it needs to be cleaned off with something so this works so good i live by it so after i have washed my body i've exfoliated i've washed my coochie now it's time to get to them underarms y'all i only use this which is panoxy for my underarms i used to be so like insecure about my body odor and just how easy it was for me to sweat and like i did i'm not ashamed like baby we all get a little musty sometimes but after i started my whole like getting into hygiene more and just learning about like what really works for my body and just instead of just buying stuff I am so confident in like my scent. I get compliments literally like every day about how I smell and it makes me feel good because when you smell good, you're obviously going to feel good. You just, it just completes my whole aura. So I use Panoxy for my underarms because I haven't found like a wash that just eliminates body odor for the whole day. Like no i have never i've never came across that until i started using panoxy and it's benzyl peroxide which you can use for your face and um, acne and things like that but it basically just eliminates any body odor that you would get i let it sit for like one or two minutes and as i'm like exfoliating or doing shaving whatever i just let it sit under my underarms and then i rinse it off and when i tell you you're not gonna have a scent all day like I mean that shit. I'm not just saying it. You're not going to have a scent. So after I get out the shower, then I go in with, I'm sure y'all have seen this. Like I'm sure other people have talked about it on YouTube, but I use the Ordinary and it's their toner. And I use this with like a cotton round and I just basically like wipe under my arms. And this is so that it prevents you from sweating. The Panoxy and the Ordinary together, it's a powerful combination. Like you are missing out especially if you suffer from body odor and you just live like don't do it don't be that girl like that's no i'm trying to put y'all on now so y'all don't have to go through it because 
baby i used to dance like i was i'm an active person like just sweating and like having to reapply deodorant and it's not really masking anything it's just like it's just not a good look so the ordinary and panoxy together is gonna have you smelling fresh you can literally stop at this but baby i gotta take it up a notch just to make sure that i'm not gonna have a scent this degree deodorant it's a men's deodorant it's cool rush 48 antiperspirant deodorant it's going to completely eliminate any type of odor that wants to arise like it's not letting it's not letting it happen so this deodorant is super good it's the degree men's because women's deodorant not, nothing wrong with women's deodorant but sometimes just depending on what it is it does tend to like wear off throughout the day and i feel like they men's just they trying to make sure that shit locked in so i need to be locked in my favorite lotion to smell like when i tell y'all this lotion is gonna linger on your clothes like when you take off your clothes for the day after a long day you're still gonna smell this lotion this is my favorite lotion i fucking love this lotion it's like I said, I'm more into mature scents now. I just want something fresh, but you smell it when you walk by me. And this is the Righteous, the Righteous Butter Body Lotion by Soap and Glory. Soap and Glory is literally underrated. Like they don't get enough props. These two scents, I think they. Let me see. Do they smell alike or am I sure? Hold on, y'all, because I gotta make sure. Let me see. Okay, no, they don't smell alike, but they complement each other. When I tell y'all I get so many compliments, sometimes I don't even put on any, like, perfume. I'll just put this lotion on, and it just does what it needs to do. So, like I said, this is the Righteous Butter Body Lotion by Soap & Glory. You can get Soap & Glory from Target, and I believe you can also get it from Ulta. I forgot to tell y'all about my little toner trick. So, when you get out the shower... <sighs> When we sweat down there, it can sometimes cause a scent. And, you know, your butthole can actually cause a scent, too, if you're not really getting in there, which we all should be really getting in there. I like to go in with this Thayer's toner, and it's the lemon flavor. It's holy grail. When I tell y'all holy grail, you're going to take a cotton pad, go in between your legs, like, in between your vagina and your leg crease and just wipe right there do not wipe your vagina it's gonna sting it's gonna hurt it's gonna fuck up your ph balance don't do it this is just for like the skin that sweats around your like vagina and when i tell you you're not gonna sweat all day baby you're not gonna sweat all day and i also like to wipe my booty hole out after i get out the shower just to make sure that it's extra squeaky clean because that's what carries odor as well do not forget your butthole and if it's any men watching these tips are you can use them too like besides the vagina stuff and like besides all that you can use these too you can be cleaning around there too so like i said this is the thayer's um toner and lemon i'm about to put y'all down real quick because it's unfortunate that this perfume is so expensive, but I just fucking, I need to stop cussing. I just really love this perfume. It lasts all day. And when you can like put your clothes in the dirty clothes and like you walk past the dirty clothes and it still smells like the scent, I don't, it's just a win-win. So right now, my favorite one, you already know, is this Baccarat 540. It really does work so good. It really smells amazing. Like, I, I love it. But this used to be, like, my favorite perfume. And it's cheap and affordable. But for some reason, I recently put it on, like, maybe, like, two weeks ago. And I broke out into hives. I don't know if my skin's changed. Like, I don't know what's going on, but you could tell, like, I used it up because I really did enjoy this perfume. I don't even know if they still sell it, for real. But this is from Victoria's Secret, and it is the Coconut Passion. It smells so good. But let me put y'all on a little trick, okay? So after you get out the shower, what you're going to want to do is, before you put on any lotion, before you dry off, before you do anything, you're going to want to spray yourself down with perfume, spray your whole body down, 
and let yourself air dry. So after you air dry, you're gonna smell so good because you just sprayed all that perfume on. Don't dry off, like I said, just air dry. So then when you put on your moisturizer and all of that fun stuff, then you're gonna go ahead and spray it again, like with your clothes on and everything. And you're gonna smell good all day. As a woman, we have a lot of intricate parts of our body just the way our body is designed you need to make sure that you're taking vitamins or just making sure that your ph balance is leveled so i told y'all that i was gonna start taking these probiotics from sweet cookie and when i tell y'all they work so good you know see these phg they're boric acid vaginal suppositories you can get these from cvs i've seen them at target amazon you can get them from like any type of grocery store and you just pop one in. I like to put one in at least once a week and definitely, if not once a week, just definitely after I get off my period because yeah, like these are going to wipe out all that nasty, dirty shit. It's just going to get you back to a stable pH balance. Washes are only going to do so much. It you know, they're only going to do so much. You got to take a probiotics. Just make sure that you're balanced all around. When I tell y'all, if you use all these products, you are literally not going to smell. Like, you're not going to have a scent. I put this on. I don't like putting stuff on nothing, but I really, I'm serious, y'all. Like, for real. For real. For real, okay? Lastly, 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 you know, when our hair is a little oily and a little dirty and with a lot of products, our hair can also like mess up that smelling good. If your whole body smells good, but your hair doesn't smell good, like it's kind of just like defeats the point of doing all that work. But I really like these little hair sprays. They're like hair mist or whatever i got this one from target and i spray this in my hair like after i get out the shower just to complete the whole smelling good like it's gonna it's gonna take it up a notch this is the cloud in the um scent cloud musk it's hair and body mist so you can use this for your hair and then go ahead and spray it on your body my hair doesn't usually smell bad because i'm using like good smelling products but say if it's like I don't know like I'm trying to get because my hair don't really stink like um <laughs> maybe like I don't do it to like mask a smell I do it to like elevate my scent like I don't do it to mask anything but just if you haven't washed your hair in a minute and it's nothing wrong with not washing your hair for a minute because baby stripping all them oils especially for curly hair girls you know we don't like to wash our hair all the time so all them products and all that build up sometimes do have do be having a little scent and yeah it just sm makes you smell that much more like fresh so that completes how to smell good all summer long no sweating no scent no odor no nothing i just put y'all down like if you don't get all of these items just like improving your hygiene especially during this hot ass summer it's gonna make you feel better for one and it's just gonna make you smell so 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 good so i hope y'all enjoyed this video thank y'all for watching and i love y'all